Food insecurity affects thousands of families here in central Illinois, and that's why the Eastern Illinois Food Bank will be leaving the warehouse and hitting the road to reach more people. WCI3's Karina Rubio has more. To be able to go into small rural communities and um, disproportionately affected neighborhoods, neighborhoods that we might not be able to serve otherwise. Eastern Illinois Food Bank, or EIF, will be able to do just that thanks to a $417,000 grant from Feeding America's COVID-19 Response Fund. We're purchasing a beverage truck, which is smaller, and the sides roll up, and it's refrigerated. This will help EIF staff add 50 mobile food distribution sites in rural communities. The truck will travel to the underserved areas with the food distributed directly from it. But a new set of wheels isn't the only thing money can buy. We've all heard the saying that food is medicine. There might be a go-to meal that you eat when you're feeling sick. That's why part of this new initiative includes expanding the food bank's inventory for better health benefits. CUPHD Deputy Administrator Oais Vade co-founded the Friends of Champaign County Food Pantry. He's helping bring more culturally diverse options to EIF for groups of people that have been most impacted by the pandemic. More than half the population that we serve comes, you know, is, is traditionally non-white. So African Americans, uh, Hispanics, uh, you know, Guatemalans, uh, Asians. In the beginning, we were assuming what they wanted to eat, so we were providing them those things. We very quickly learned that different cultures have different needs. Vade says swapping out bread for tortillas or pita and adding more avocados and mangoes to a basic fruit basket can go a long way. They're going to learn from what they need. They're going to make that effort to provide them what they need. In Champaign, Karina Rubio, WCI3, your local news leader. Some of the areas the EIF truck will travel to include Danville neighborhoods as well as Coles, McLean, and Jasper counties. They have an advisory group helping to map out other destinations and new product selection.